fat, slow, scrawny, and lanky. These are all words that were used by others to describe me. These, however, can never define me. Growing up, I was overweight, not just a few pounds heavier than the normal kid, but significantly and noticeably heavier than the other kids around me. I had my brief wonders on why I felt different, but those thoughts were only shallow, and I felt fine with who I was for the most part. Even laughed at myself along with others when jokes would be made about me. My viewpoint, however, would come to a drastic change in the matter of one summer after leaving the home I spent the majority of my life in and the friends I'd surrounded myself with over the past six grades and before. Leaving my hometown of Chanhassen, Minnesota and landing in Egan, Minnesota with my parents and their fresh new careers meant a change for me. I had never before been the new kid. I was used to my same old friends, my same old school, and my same old life. This transition is where I came to an all-time low in how I looked at myself and my worth and who I really was. The summer before seventh grade in a brand new school in a brand new city brought isolation and depression that I never experienced before until age 13. I quickly developed habits of locking myself in my room on nice summer days and shutting the world out because I did not have the confidence to venture out into the new world I was forced to inhabit. All the while I was going through drastic changes in my body and how I look. This summer was the summer I went from being fat, overweight, and out of breath to skinny, scrawny, and undefined. I grew five inches and went from one extreme to another in a matter of months. Everything was somewhat fine, but my confidence and self-esteem had nearly vanished. Vanished just like I had from the life I had been previously living. One day, however, I came to the point where I as my own self felt that I needed to make a change for me. This change needed to happen for me to feel comfortable with my own life and give me inspiration and motivation for everything I would later encounter. One afternoon on the bus ride home in seventh grade, a girl sitting near me turned to me and asked me why I was so scrawny. This is the day I came to wanting a change and really looking at the person I wanted to be. I was not happy with who I was and all the harsh comments I had received during my childhood. I had been called fat and slow and now I was skinny and scrawny. I had to make a change for the better. This change helped me develop the passion I have today for living healthy and free through exercise and sensible eating. This passion has fueled me to always working towards personal goals and has transferred me into all categories of my life with academics, sports, and even my relationships with those around me. Choosing to live a healthier lifestyle and always striving to make progress saved me from myself, from the timid, unconfident being that I became through an awkward stage and finding home in an unfamiliar place. I know myself and I know my worth. This is why I believe it to being my story and the story I will continue to write on my journey through life and living my passion of good health to its fullest.